Over the past four years, Spendthrift Farm has added three Met Mile winners to their stallion roster. We spoke with Mark Toothaker on the stallion making potential Spendthrift believes can be found in the race. And we visited with the 2020 Met Mile winner, Vacoma, who will stand his first year at stud this year. Vacoma, uh, with his two year old year, he was undefeated. So he broke his maiden first time out, was able to come back and win a stake in his next start. And as a three-year-old, he made the trip down to Florida and ran a very good race in the Fountain of Youth where he uh, uh, was behind Code of Honor. Uh, then he came back and uh, put on a tremendous performance out here at Keeneland in the bluegrass. Unfortunately, Derby Day, you know, wasn't his best day, uh, but he came back, you know, from that off the layoff to uh, go three for three uh, this last year. Uh, capped off with a tremendous win in the Met Mile where he defeated three grade one winners. He broke well. He just sat right there and just waited, you know, till his time and got his cue in the stretch and, you know, opened up and, you know, drew off in, in what was just a very, uh, very dominating performance. And, you know, that race has been such a sire making race. It was no different this year with, you know, you had Code of Honor in there and Hog Creek Hustle and, of course, a four-time grade one winner in McKenzie. So a very talented field of horses that he was able to beat that day and, and beat them pretty soundly. Vacoma continues the battle on down at the rail. It is Vacoma who's going to win the run. Happy Met Mile. Vacoma the winner. He also won the Carter, which was a grade one. He got 110 buyer that day, which really just laid over the sprint division as far as buyers go for this year. And uh, just George and his wife, Cindy, did a tremendous job managing his campaign and uh, just extremely excited to have him in here. Spencer, you know, we had been looking for a son of candy ride for a while. And, and so this horse, you know, when we had a chance to go up there and see him, uh, felt like he was the one that we had been looking for. And so to have three, you know, Met Mile winners here at Spencer standing here, um, They've all been supported very well. All have gotten really big books of mares. So now they just got to go do the deal on the racetrack. Vacoma, you know, he comes out of just an extremely strong mare. His mother, you know, was a grade one winner uh, being by Spitestown. And it's the family of Mr. Greeley. And so, you know, we love that, uh, that we had a, you know, top sire right there, uh, close up in his intermediate family. And then uh, to be out of a mare that, you know, was able to, you know, win the ultimate winner grade one. Uh, we just felt like that, you know, Vacoma is what, you know, what we were looking for. Vacoma physically really looks a lot like a Spitestown. You know, he's got good bone. He's got a really strong body with a really good hip. I can foresee him having just absolute beautiful rocket ship, you know, weanlings here at the sale uh, down the road. So his body looks very precocious and he was so fast and hated to lose. So, you know, looking forward to uh, getting the mares to him this year and, and uh, seeing what the foals look like in 2022. Thank you for watching our visit with Vacoma at Spendthrift Farm. Be sure to subscribe for more content from the TDN.